driving challenge. Now this is one that lots of people like to play because you can stand up there and bomb it for fun. With driving challenge, it's exactly what it says on the tin. It's an opportunity to test your ability to drive the golf ball. So if we just pick again, we've got multiple courses that we can choose from. So this time if we choose Torrey Pines, again it's going to ask you to select the set of tees that suit you best. So the short tees are the red ones, the middle tees are the yellow, and the longer tees are the blue tees. So I'm going to select the middle tee. Again, it's going to ask us to select a, a target on the range. So for me, that 224 pole is ideal for hitting driver towards. And so once the game mode opens up, you'll see that you've got your virtual hole in front, and it's giving you a flyover of the hole. This is showing where the flag is. And in an ideal scenario, all we're trying to do now is just hit that ball as far as we can on that target line. Now you can see in the little mini map here on the right hand side that it will flash up where the highest scores are going to come from. So that the longer and the straighter you hit the golf ball, the more points you're going to gain. And the person with the most points at the end obviously is the winner. Again, there are leaderboards for this. Um, in your Top Tracer app. So when you come out the game mode after your nine drives, it's going to give you a total score, which will then go on the leaderboard for the range, for the country, and, and a global leaderboard as well. So really good game mode where you can get that driver out and really give it the message and see just exactly how good are you off the tee.